What's up YouTube? This is Bud TV here with another video for you guys. And for this episode, I'll be showing you how to replace a 2001 model Honda CRV speedometer gauge. For this DIY session, all you need to have as a tool is a Phillips screwdriver, which will be useful in removing all the screws that is on the gauge. Now, I was able to remove two screws right here on top. That's the only lock that the cluster gauge have in order for you to remove this frame. So let's try to remove it now. All you need to do is to just squeeze it gently so that it would release. Just like that. You can see that there are four frame screws that is attached from the dashboard to your gauge. So let's go ahead and remove the four screws so we can pull out the cluster gauge itself. Now this Honda CRV is a 2001 model. It's an automatic transmission and uh, it is the last model that was released for its generation. For 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 some people who doesn't have any idea, this is the first generation of Honda CRV which was released on its line. So I was able to remove the first top two screws. And I'm working my way in removing the third screw at the bottom. So there's two types of screws that I've discovered. So this one. This screw right here, which what which I removed at the bottom part of the gauge, are, are are different from the screws that I remove on top. So please make sure that when you put them back, this type of screw would be here at the top. And this one will be at the bottom. So let's go ahead and finish off and remove this. Just be careful. Not to lose the screws, it might fall on the on the dashboard and it would cost you more problems. And you know, who knows when you start the car, it would give you more vibrations. That'll be a problem. So I'm pulling it away gently just to make sure I don't pull any loose wires or you know damage any any brittle plastics found on the dashboard. So I was able to pull it out, but I guess the better way to pull this off easily is to remove the wirings first like this got the first one the second one
third one. And I think I got it. There's one more clip right here. So, let's not forget about it. Okay, so, we got the gauge. So we were able to remove the old gauge or the speedometer, including the cluster and the lenses. And uh, this is what we'll be putting back in. This came from Japan, also from a Honda CRV, but they call it Honda CRV Performa. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, put them back. So putting everything back, here is our gauge. Have to be careful not to scratch the da uh, scratch the dashboard, and uh, we have to put the wirings back in reverse order. That's the first one. Make sure every every wiring is all locked up and tight. So second, third is locked up tight and we're on our last wiring harness. There. Once you hear the click, it's all good. Now all you need to do is put everything back together in reverse order of things. Okay, so I was able to mount everything, all the screws and stuff, before you close the cluster and put back the frame. You have to make sure everything is in working condition. So let's take a look if this one lights, and if it functions, you have to start your engine, you have to start your car, make sure everything's working fine. Okay, um, seems that everything is working well with our gauge. We can now put back our cluster. So everything's working well, and there you have it, DIY, speedometer gauge, 
replacement for a 2001 Honda CRV first generation RD1. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment if you have any questions, and uh, please subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thank you for your support. I'll see you again next time. This is Bud TV saying, adios.